for him to go back around. So another time, Stephen Page, everybody. Woo! Or Steve, as I recently found out, I'm talking about the Congress. I was fine. Yeah, my dad calls me Steve, I think, right? You're, I'm Steve to you, by Steven to. Uh, Mom, are you. I'm Steven to you? Okay. <laughs> um, so, if you were to uh, split me 50 50 as I am, I'm you know, half my dad and half my mom. I'm Steve. 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 Yeah. yeah. At the end, half, I'm probably Steve. <laughs> Steve. Um, now, you, you mentioned to me uh, in soundcheck that you're, you're working on a new record, and page one, um, and as my hands would so beautifully say, uh, I'm not trying to blow sunshine up your hole. It's okay, um, I can use a little sunshine up there. Yeah. <laughs> 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 um, well, hold on. <laughs> well, I, I, I am Aww. wondering what the process. After so many years of making uh, kind of collaborative records with the band, now that you're making solo records, uh, how do you find the, the process to be to be different? You know, in a lot of ways, they're always collaborative. Like it doesn't really. I mean, even when I'm by myself in my basement making a record, which I've done, I've, I've, I've done um, singles and individual songs just totally by myself. But you know, there's a point where you're collaborating with with anybody, whether it's the mastering engineer or it's your management or it's even with you know, the people you bounce ideas off of, friends who are musicians and that kind of thing. Um, but I, you know, for me, developing a, a, a new live band was, a, was an adventure because it's you know, being with the same group of guys for over 20 years and then jumping in with a bunch of other people. You don't want to feel like just kind of pick up session guys. And we've been, I've been very lucky to kind of develop a little family inside of my, my new band. And I don't know if that happens all the time. It's a solo artist with, with other people around. You know, it's just a nice. It's a nice feeling. I think. I think part of me always looks for that collaboration. That's what I'm doing with this record. I was saying before that uh, we worked with Craig Northey a lot, I mean, I just went and did a, a week of recording with with his band, The Odds, and it was great because it didn't feel like I was just kind of fronting another band. You know, we were still working together, and that's the way music is. You know, even on a vibrational level. The, of the notes, you know, like it's, it's different when you just lay down one track of your own voice and then one track of your own guitar. But when it's against somebody else, it just makes something it's completely new. Do you have a, so, uh, can you give us a hint? When, is this, when can we see this new record of yours? Oh, it's not coming out. <laughs> <laughs> no one buys records anymore. It's just my own for my own enjoyment. <laughs> I have no idea, actually. Um, you know, it depends on what, when I get this stuff done and when if we uh, end up actually doing another season of this TV show, who knows? I mean, there's so many variables with that kind of thing. But if it was up to me, I kind of like people to put a song out every week or so. But right, because uh, I've been sitting on a lot of these songs for so long, I, it's now a concept record. I figured out a whole three line through the whole thing. It's, it's, now, it's, now, it's, now, three, it's like it's like uh, three CDs. It's, it's twenty one twelve. It's our version. <laughs> Except it's, um, uh, instead of being Ayn Rand inspired, it's, um, it's, it's socialist. <laughs> <laughs> a guy picks up a guitar at the beginning, and then he goes, hey, who else wants to play this with me? <laughs> that was for me. My own take on him. That was good. You liked page one so much, Tom. Yeah, man. Woo. I'm gonna sing this for you. Oh, God love you. So I try to talk seriously about, about what music makes me feel. I, it's very uncomfortable when I'm joking. So I'm gonna stop that now. I don't like what you've seen. <laughs> Try to take this song more ironically than it comes across. <laughs> <laughs> if you can or you want to protect me, please do that. <laughs> I'm top four forever. <laughs> Fantasy, oh no, never. Wait till you hear 
the chorus girl. Snow drop in some school. A song to make you show. Wait till you hear the chorus girl. No cocaine and no discos. Oh, I gave her for the chorus girl. Look out of the window. People move down below. Each one is in love with the chorus girl. Now you've tried to ignore her, to write at those who adore her. But soon you'll come around to the chorus girl. Chorus girl, <laughs> at night all alone with my mind, oh, never come close to. I'm waiting for you now. Oh, there's nothing to do now. Oh, but save your breath for the chorus girl. Sometime later, it becomes the soundtrack to somebody else's first year in university. So, yeah. Woo! It's, it's the, the theme song to their family camping trip. It's the one pop song your grandma knows. You might not even like it, but you know it. You can't get rid of it. It's like Barbie Girl or something. 
which I wish to God I didn't. But anyway. <laughs> well, I'm sorry, I, I mean, I'm so thankful. Um, the problem with that, I mean, the nice thing is that you come and, and you sing a song like that in front, of people, in front of people, but you're not just doing it in front of people. They're singing it back at you, or they're singing it in the air. We're all just doing it together. Like that song is not yours anymore. I don't feel bad about that. I feel grateful. The problem is, I, I want more. I'm not satisfied with this one. So maybe the song really is about the fact that I want to write that perfect chorus that everybody can sing. And the joke is that there is no chorus in the song. <laughs> Enough. Enough of this. This whole kind of self-deprecating. I can't do it. I'm a hefty. You know what? No, you're just, you are what you are. Just get to work. Stop complaining. So I get it. I pulled myself up and I, I looked myself inside of myself, you know. And I looked inside the song. There was a chorus there, man. There was a chorus there all along. Thank you.